we're back on another episode of Is It Smoking? I'm here with my brother Kevin, childhood friend, you feel me? It's your host, Della Pax Focus, aka Della Pax, aka directed by Della Pax. I got so many fucking names. Directed man. by Della Pax? Oh, directed by Della Paz. My bad, man. So many fucking names. But you know what it is. I'm right here with my boy Kevin. And today we about to be smoking two flavors. We're going to do two reviews. The first one we're going to smoke is called White Cherry Gelato. You feel me? That, that's, that's what it's looking like. And then the one we about to really smoke is this one right here. And we call this Baby Jesus. Hey, it be like that, brother. It be like that. How, 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 uh, what you think of that white cherry gelato? Oh, shoot. That shit smells good. Okay, check that on now. I'm for sure about to slap that in the bar when I get home. Yes, sir. Oh, this the baby Jesus? That's that baby Jesus right there. I ain't mad at the baby Jesus. You ain't mad at the baby it's Jesus, pretty. right? When you look at both of these, you said this one looked more gassy though, right? And yeah. that one looked more fruity? Yeah, this one's called white cherry, but this is fruity. It's called baby Jesus. Crazy, right? And when you smell this one, uh, do it smell like anything to you? Or um, is, it, is, it, is it fucking, um, it, just, it just smells a little... No, that one's like earthy. And like, like I said, it smells sweet. Where this one is just like that. Just that fucking... You remember you opened the jar up to like 2014 type shit? <laughs> <laughs> that 2012 to 2014 type weed and it's like, mm, that shit a little, shit a gas. Okay, so look, let me tell you a little backstory on this one. This one right here is what niggas normally would like to call a faker pack. Because it looked good, it smelled good, but it's not cultivated the same way that other one was cultivated. So... Yeah. I want to I want to roll this one and then I'm gonna roll the other one and then I want you to give me your honest review on both of them. You know, show me what the fuck going on, man. Yes, sir. But th don't get it wrong. Right. Don't get it wrong. The white the white cherry gelato is a is a popular strain too. But it, it in my opinion, it's just you know no, it's nothing like the baby uh, you know baby Jesus, you know. But um, to each his own, and the best way to do it is to just try it out and test it out. But the best thing to do is to see if this shit is smoking. So shit, bro. Originally today, you, you just got off of work. You was about to go hit the, the golf range. I guess in a sense, we kind of still did hit the golf range. Yeah, no, nah, man. I, once we done here, I'm going right back behind us. You got your clubs on with you? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Let's do it. I'm, I'll am i go right with you, I too. Keep them in, I, keep them, I keep them in the truck. Ain't no fucking point, bro. Let's do it, bro. I got time to burn, bro. I got, I, I'm filming um, Swaggy P later, so I'm, I might as well make it happen. If you want, we can even play, bro. I got I got but I got three clubs. I got a pitcher, <laughs> I got the 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 hybrid, and then I got my putter. Why well, only got three? I, I didn't want to bring all the clubs with me today. Just wanted to have no, three. If you look in there, you'll see I just separated them. I'm about to take some of them shit to either donate them or take them to a pro shop, sell them for the for the cheap. What your clubs? Yeah. You just don't like them no more, or what? No, nah, I got too much of the same shit. Oh, you're just upgrading. Yeah, I'm upgrading. Oh shit, my nigga upgrading. I know you can. Why not? I know you. You about to have all of them, boy. <laughs> Shit. Well, let's turn this one up. Are you done? Are you done already? I just wrote the first one. The I just want to let the white cherry gelato. Whoever's watching this, I don't know if this fact has come up yet. My man Ernesto was last in the group to learn how to roll. It used to take him so long to roll that we would never let him roll. Shit, there was no point. We'd be waiting forty-five minutes to smoke one blunt, one joint. So to see what I've seen today, it kind of don't make no sense. Hey, you know what it is, bro? I stopped hanging out with so many niggas, <laughs> man. I kind of started just staying to myself. And when I realized that, I realized, nigga, I got to learn how to fuck you roll. figure that shit out yourself. It was post-pandemic, nigga, was by himself all the time. For real, bro. Because before, I used to just tell whoever with me, yo, roll up, hit a weed, roll up, roll up. back to their real life. It's hard out here for a pimp. Big facts. Bro, my nigga ain't got not to drop a grabber. Not to drop. I don't do tobacco. I'm yeah, sorry, but uh, drop. so that's that white cherry gelato. No, when you hit it, no, I, we need to marinate. If there's no grabber, RIP. Moment of silence you for know. the grabber. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know a bunch of niggas that be smoking with me. That used to smoke mad, 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 but was with me. 
now probably be like, what the fuck? I know this nigga be, what he talking about not smoking tobacco? This nigga used to be tobacco king. So how you feel, um, what's going on with the, with the weed game right now? How do you feel everything's uh, kind of moving? Like, from the time you started smoking to today, like, how, what's been the culture for you and your experience out here being somebody that lived in that in the A1A, you feel me? Yeah, well, first and foremost, I don't feel like I'm a nigga involved with weed culture. I'm a nigga who really likes to smoke weed. So, <laughs> and, nigga, you know, I ain't going nowhere. That's all like, you need. Yeah, that's nah, all you need to like, be involved with the weed culture. I'm not really the type of nigga that be like, bro, like, this shit. I know this shit tests at 28%. Like, I don't really get, I know names. I know what's the sativa, what's the indica, you know what I mean? Like, but. You, you're not the one to be trying to, th- yeah, I know. I get you. I'm not. I'm you, not. I'm not like that either, though. You do know. I like. I like really good weed. I'm a weed kind of sore. That's what you but are. I'm not going to sit back and debate and have like long-winded conversations about weed. But with that being said, you've been pulling up on me with some heat lately. Hey, bro. I just really got more into this shit, bro. I. I. It, it stopped being. It stopped being about fucking trying to make a buck. And I realized, like, you know what, bro? I'm not. I don't sell weed or, or, or grow weed because I'm trying to get rich off it. I really yeah. genuinely like weed. So yeah, I've been figured out. So I was like, you know what? If I'm really gonna do this shit, why not do it to the highest, best capability that I could do it? Of course, I'm not about to invest my money because I got my own job and stuff and everything else I got going on. But on a smaller scale, I'm gonna do it because I know knowledge. It's very important, gang, and fuck. I, I, I know, nigga. No, baby steps, though. You said you were doing small back shit opposed to, like... Yeah. Trying to... Yeah, I don't know what a lighter is. But, uh, yeah, baby steps, nigga. Small back sounds good. You get to focus, like, opposed to being stretched thin. Trying to make a big operation happen. Like, you're on a good track, man. You've been doing this shit for a little over a year and a half. Like, it ain't even... You ain't even hit two years yet. So... Have you even been growing? Yeah, you've been growing for a year. Yeah, no, nah, I've been growing since, uh, like, three years now. Yeah, so, shit. Like I said. I went pretty crazy with this shit, yeah. Yeah, you had a, you going at a good pace. My man had a townhouse in NoHo. It was a respectable place. You know, us being, I feel like us being in our younger 20s, we fucked that shit up. That's why I call it just respectable. It's not, right. It wasn't a hell of a nice move. We tore through that shit in our younger 20s, but once you started growing weed, boy, you turned into a fucking machine, an operation. It was like, nigga, ain't no kicking it. That's the weed spot right there. For real. It went from yeah, a kicking spot to the weed spot nigga, there was quick. No, not a couch, not a stool, nothing. Not nigga. nothing. If you went in there, you just to really... You standing up and watering these plants. Yeah, are you going to help me water these plants? Yeah, no. Nah, fi- bro, anything you do, you do that shit. So, you know, I feel like if this is what you're going to do, Starting small, it's good for you, my nigga. You, Cause you can, I feel like a new venture like this, you can get over your head quick, get in over your head quick, and you come in about it real correct. Ooh, Thank you, shit. bro. I appreciate that. Nah, for real, bro. I'm just with this shit, bro. Taking it one step at a time, bro. Not, not really trying to, not really trying to overdo it. Just like I said, taking it one step at a time, learning at my own speed, but at the same time. Blessing everybody that asks me, like, hey, do you know how to grow? Yeah, bro, I do know how to grow. And here, it costs this much. I'll teach you, and then I'll do the first run with you. Once you get comfortable, I'm out. You do your shit. You want genetics? I'll give you genetics. But I'm just taking it slow. And honestly, bro, I'm at a point in my life, bro, where I've realized I'm going to be growing weed for the rest of my life. Like, I'm I'm always going to have it in my backyard or in a garage somewhere. Like, it's just, I, I like to smoke, and I... I'm not the type to be shopping at a dispensary every day. It's not it's not me. So I'm always gonna have a little grow and I like to smoke what I grow because I know I smoked it right. I didn't add no crazy adjectives like organic grown. I know what it takes now, you know? So Yeah. No, what I appreciate about uh you brought me the space packs last week and it was good. Cause I have to, to even get like a slight flavor or feel of the shit that you brought me. Like I said, you've been going crazy the last couple weeks. Like, bro, I have to go buy a $70 eighth from like, you know, like one of the designer shops. Like, I had some shit called, I don't know if we big, en- if we big enough on the weed, but 
it was called like traditionals, traditional LA. Bro, that's what all we doing with this show. Yeah. Is, if it's good weed, we putting it up. Traditional LA. It was one of the best weeds I had. But you know, you got to go pay eighty dollars an eighth to get knocked off your feet like you used to. Like I said, bro, I be searching for the shit that used to knock me up, that knocks me off my feet. Like I feel you. It used to. And with that being said, how do you feel about this shit that we just been smoking? Yeah, that's what I said. In the last week, we been going. Well, not, not, not just the, the good thing is, is the mics. <laughs> planes flying over us, but these mics is hearing us way cooler, so we could talk over the planes. But what I was going to say, um, um, so this, this, we, we haven't smoked the baby GC yet. Yeah, no, we I'm not. going off the white cherry gelato. Yeah, the white cherry gelato is good, bro. Like, it's a cool smoke. You yeah. like it? How, how would you, you describe the high? I mean, shit. I, I call, personally, I, call I it full body. I feel that shit in my spine, in my lower back. But you're right. It's like a body high. It's not. Yeah. A, it's not. It's not a mental high. No. Yeah, I'm not mentally high at all. Like at all, at all. Like I'm not gonna lie. That's why. That's why this one. I. 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 I, I um. I rolled it up before I rolled up the baby Jesus because, bro, this shit on my mama doesn't fucking get me high. I don't get high off this. That's why I kind of wanted to test yeah, you out. Get, like something to chill, relax. Yeah, it's just a, it's a, it's, that's what it is. Yeah, my mind move a mile a minute, bro. I don't really need nothing that's gonna make <laughs> like I'm not like not in the sense of not stimulate my mind, but I'm cool off of like something that's gonna sh- shoot straight to the head. Fire, fire. Now, good shit, good shit. Nah. So, all right. So, on a scale from one through ten, what do you, what do you, what do you, um. What are you ranking this one at? I'm get out a nice seven point six. Nice. I'll, I'll I'll give it I'll give it a six. That's me. Yeah, that's you. But See, I, that, I like that. that. I like so, that you're right know, there though. I'm with the bong. This is. Yeah, you I usually feel, like the bong. Yeah, I feel like out the bong, out the, the bong, I could probably taste it. You know, facts. Feel a little more facts. like this. Yeah. This shit right here, nigga. I'm very upset that I didn't bring my bong with me today. I usually stay strapped. But we about to roll it up. We about yeah. to see what the fuck going on with this. And remember earlier, I told him, I was like, yo, Kev, we got to meet up. We got to do this fucking review. He's like, bro, we can't do it tomorrow. I said, bro, honestly, I don't have, I don't got that much left. I don't think there's going to be nothing to do with tomorrow. And I'm look. For show tomorrow, ass nigga. Yo, but there's nothing <laughs> no wrong with that. Yo, the good thing about smoking good weed, bro, it's like, a, it's like, it's like if a famous artist is in town. Because good weed, like this one, Nigga, we had nine pounds of it. It's gone. It's gone. So down. It's sold out. So now whoever asks, yo, where'd be, baby Jesus, baby Jesus, guess what? You gotta wait. It's fucked up. You gotta wait. And I like, I like that you said I've been coming around with some fire. But then the other day you went to the to the fucking dispensary and got some shit called traditional, which is fire. Cause it's like, yeah, nigga, when a when a good artist in, is in town, you gotta get it while it's hot. That's why again, I told you, bro. We got to do this shit before this shit gone. And you're not going to be able to experience it. Because, again, it's a good artist. I, w- I want my nigga to be able to experience this. I want to be hanging out and be like, yo, how about that baby Jesus? Remember that one? And you're going to be like, oh, yeah, I remember that. You know what I mean? Yeah, no. Our, That's what I like about good weed. Our big friend Trev. Yeah. <laughs> the nigga hit me about the fucking, the baby Jesus. Like, I called it. The- I called that nigga the first thing he says, yeah, man, that's pulled up on me with the baby Jesus. Yeah, last night. I pulled up on him yesterday. You got the town talking. The birds is chirping. Hey, and it's going <laughs> to be fucked up because by the time the second wave of people start hitting, I'm going to be like, sold out, sold out, sold out, sold out. I can't wait for it to be back, too. Sold out. <laughs> that's how it be, bro. It's fucking funny. Yo, um, how about yesterday? Uh, did the Raiders win, bro? I think the Raiders are playing somebody. Them bums won. They did? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, my nigga Joey yesterday said they was going to win. I was like, okay, this nigga, he on his shit. Bro, the Ravens lost to the fucking Steelers. That's all I care about. You still a Ravens fan? Hey, man. Hey, that's what it Credit is. Credit to the grave. That's what it is. Football is a ridiculous sport, my nigga. And <laughs> Yo, this one is so... Just body high. That is, it's, it's time. It's time to bring out baby Jesus. I, I guess. Show me what you got. I guess I hyped it up enough, right? It, it's like uh, time to fucking drop the album. Drop the album. I'm about to drop this bitch right now. And it's crazy because 
we gonna be smoking different flavors, but I keep pulling out the baby Jesus on niggas because it's that special. It's just, it's like, like I said, it's not gonna be around for a long time, so I'm making sure I'm, I'm letting niggas try it while they can. You feel me? Oh man. Show, show me, nigga. Man. <laughs> And we chilling. And the good thing is the camera's about to record you experiencing this shit. That's what this is about. Because if it was just about you smoking, I would have just dropped off for an ounce or an eighth for you. Yeah. Um, you know? So this is a this, this, this is a really like patchy joint that I have special. Some shit like that. Yes, sir. This is some this is some small batch boogie. That shit I was just telling you about that me and... Small batch boogie. We small batch boogie in these niggas, bruh. We hitting these niggas like it's prom night, boy. Every every three months we coming out with that gasaroni. And that's just because of the infrastructure we got right now, but now I have never seen this technique you're using. Oh, crumbling up the paper? So when you I need you. If you put this out, you need I want that shit zoomed in on right there. This is yeah. yeah. Actually, yeah. like I said, I'm a bone guy. This might be common practice. I wouldn't know. <laughs> hey, I, I wouldn't to. know. This might be common practice. Yeah, yeah. My 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 joint rollers out there, my niggas, the one percenters, you know, you know the fuck going on when you crumble up that paper. Okay, so look, you see how this shit already scooped right there? Oh my god, right here, like oof, you see that? That was like oof, that yeah, dust yeah. in the air, boy. Angel dust. Oh shit, yeah. Okay, I I call it TLC. I call it terp terp dust, but you could call it that. Hey, man. You can call it that. Hey, man. You can call this little pookie, pookie, yeah, yeah. pookie joint. <laughs> oh yeah, little <laughs> pookie joint. <laughs> Nigga go back. Oh, that's why everybody liking that you know, shit. You know, I'm gonna be for Halloween. That's epic. <laughs> that's a good costume, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm for sure putting up Tyrone Biggums. Oh man. Mm hmm. That shit crazy. All right, we're rolled up. We're ready to for, for, take lift off on this bitch right here. This is baby Jesus. Let's see what the fuck they talking about. Jesus. I'm gonna ask you taste, high, all that, you know? So you let me know about all that. Uh huh. How you like the taste on the last one, though? Since, you know, it's still fresh in your mouth. I mean, shit. I don't have any remarks, positive or negative, about it. It was just, it was, it was, you know, yeah. I get it. It wasn't, it like, wasn't nothing that made you remember it. Like, put it this way like, we put it, if it's on the table in my house, it's gonna be gone, but it's not gonna be the first thing I go to. It's probably not gonna be, if I have options, like I usually do, it's gonna be like my third option. Options guy. And that's why I said what I said about that shit. It's cool, and the cool thing about that is, I like to call that like the Chad weed. The, 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 the big corporation the big corporations are coming in yeah but you know we got the best we got a childhood friend named Chad oh you thought I meant Chad yeah, no 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 I, know. Chad. I get it this is my name you were fine yeah yeah my bad not a, my bad but yeah all due respect to Chad's yes shout out to my nigga Chad our, our Chad our shout Chad out, only shout out to Chad all the other Chads could, could fuck and suck a dick so C-Mac C yeah, yeah yeah my nigga C-Mac uh, but yeah, bro, they're coming in and they're growing this weed, which looks good, smells good, yeah. but it doesn't have the high. Thanks. I already hit this bitch one time yeah. to light it, yeah. and I'm there. <laughs> <laughs> I, I what? To the me, <laughs> nigga. To the Elon. Ooh. You see, that's the difference between good weed and bad weed. Do you see how that other shit had us mellow chilling? You gonna see how this shit about to have us? This shit about to have us up. Light of course, of course, good sir. Light it good. Light it good. It's the difference, bro. It's crazy. It's crazy. We didn't even finish the other joint. That's why you shouldn't buy that weak ass weed. Yeah, it tastes exactly the way it smells. It's very fruity. This one? Mm -hmm. It's good. <laughs> I'm a, I like the flavor. 
what, what kind of tasty? What kind of fruity taste? Strawberry? Or like what, what you tasting? I mean, you led with strawberry. I feel like that's a leading question. We got a little strawberry hint to it. They do, right? Yeah, I mean. It's strawberry as fuck. And it feel like creamy, like strawberry cream. If, if I could name this shit and it wasn't up to me to name it, I would call this shit strawberry iced tea. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. You call it baby Jesus. This shit's sweet. It's strawberry. I would call that shit strawberry. Oh, no, no, my bad. Strawberry sweet iced tea. You got you to gotta be sweet. Got those sweet in there. Strawberry sweet iced tea. That's what I would call this shit. Strawberry sweet tea. Hey, bro, I'm watching out here. These niggas don't look no better than us. When it comes to golfing? Yeah. Bro, it's all in your head, bro. That's why when I go out there, I be hitting shit. Yeah, I need to get a new puddle, but these niggas out here looking real poop. <laughs> all right, nigga. Oh, shit, hold up. That's why that shit not hitting. Yeah, I tried to cut close it myself. Again, I was not... I was not the, the, the blunt roller. That was me. Okay. I feel I I tried to roll a joint the other day and I was like, fuck bro, young me would never believe this. Where do I rank as far as top rollers that you know? Or did I? In my life? Yeah. You're up there, gang. I always felt like I was top I I in my eyes I'm like, nigga, I'm the best roller around, nigga, I put the filters in it, it's fast. But were you, do, am I in your top five rollers? You know what? Because that's a big deal, nigga. That's a big deal. <laughs> Definitely top ten, nigga. Not top five, though. All right, well, we're going to end, we end the interview right here. Because I got a couple niggas, bro. I got a nigga named Dummy Tux. That's his name. we end in the interview right here. <laughs> that's, that's just that nigga name, gang. <laughs> that nigga named Dummy Tux. That's his name, bro. It's not a good name. And then, hold up. Nigga, that, that's a lot of good rollers, nigga. Shit, honestly, you... Okay, this shit, oh. <laughs> Ooh, what you mean? <laughs> what you mean? <laughs> Ooh, this bitch got you running, baby Jesus. <laughs> Is this the Skittles or the candy? That's what it is. It's a it's a it's a strawberry banana uh, crossed with the Skittles. This is actually the perfect time to start golfing. We, we, we oh shit, we about to get this shit in right now. It's all good. It's all good. Shit, stand on his own. Yeah, this shit is. The flavor is definitely. Uh, in, in personal opinion, bro, that's what the fuck we're here for. The other stuff is more my speed. But once wow. again, I prefer to have the side of bone. I can't give you my real. Your real, like, your real thing to right hit out a ball. Like, like, I, this ain't me, right here. This a is, paper. Yeah, you, you're not, like you're a, not experiencing it the, the way you would do it. Yeah, he's like, this feels like an out of body experience. Like, who am I right now? But the other one is more my speed. That's crazy. But I feel like the as, far as, weed. as far as hitting it out the joint, I like the other one. But I want to try this out, my ball. Yeah, bro. And hey, that's the beautiful thing about weed, bro. It's all about. That flavor is all about what you think, you feel me? Different strokes for different folks. Yeah, gang. And that's something I'm starting to fucking really understand. But then it gets to a level where some shit is just fire, nigga. Um, you know what I mean? It gets to a point where some shit is just like, yo, what up, nigga? That's that gasorona. The gasorona. I guess that's why... I be doing this shit. I really be trying to find that one percentage of genetics. Uh, uh -huh. Until you can get like a, a Pepsi. 
you know what I'm saying? Like that perfect flavor with the cola. Yeah. I don't know why I said Pepsi and Coca Cola is real good. At the same time, I was like, so which one do you like, nigga? Coca Cola or Pepsi? I haven't had soda in so long, my nigga. When the last time you had a soda? Like a month ago? It's been some years since I had a soda. Good shit. That don't make me any better. I drink wine, man. Except for these last two weeks, I probably have a glass a night. So I ain't no better. Hey, niggas that drink wine live, live a long time. We'll see. <laughs> they do, nigga. Law, law averages, bro. Every nigga that drink wine ain't living long. He said, we'll see. <laughs> Yo, this shit hit him, man. Yeah, uh, I'm high for sure. Like, there's no doubts about it. Hey, you want to know what's crazy? So, we 30. We almost 31. Yeah. Have you been doing like more? Have you been doing like more old nigga shit than ever before? Like I use a whole lot of old nigga sayings and cliches. Now. Nigga, I'm golfing. Nigga, let's just start there. Boom. Hey, but if you would have told me, <laughs> I've been golfing at 30. I'll tell you, shut the fuck remember, up. If you would have told us at 18, sitting in my garage smoking weed, doing the wild shit we was doing, that we gonna golf four times a week. I would tell you you was lying, bro. I would tell you you lying, nigga. Get the fuck out of here. That's what that's what I would say. Look at us. Yeah, this is wild, bro. And not just golfing. Like I, I know what you mean. Like the state, that state, that state of mind, that that type of those type of activities. Like that's just what we on right now. Yeah, no, it made me understand. Even like the fact I'm making clothes. I made this sweater I got on, but Jay Z said it a long time ago. If Hove, all your sweaters is hard, all of them. If somebody would have told you that Hove would sell clothing, not in this lifetime, wasn't in my right, right mind. mind. You're right. We're maturing, maturing, what? if you will. Yeah, no, fine. Tailor made. We were made dope. Now, now this shit getting tailored. That's what these. That's what I call these years, the years of the tailor man. Because if you don't start really tailoring yourself, finding a cool little groove in these next couple of years, nigga. Yeah. I'm figuring it out. I feel like I'm figuring it out quick. I've been trying a lot of new shit lately, which, like, leads into a new thought. It's kind of, yeah. It's kind of what it's about. Like what? What you mean? Like, coughing. I went axe throwing. I'm leading a lot more. Axe throwing is fun, nigga. Yeah. Like just doing, just doing shit. Like you know me, bro. I don't like to leave the house. I don't want to talk to nobody. I don't want no new friends. You've been my friend for almost for damn near twenty years. You know? We ain't been friends the whole time, but I met you when I was I met you when I was nine or ten years old. I've been his nigga friend since then. I don't know what the fuck he talking about. You know, okay, but you not not like how he was in high school, nigga. No, no, I knew fact. you. It was every day. Every yeah, day. exactly. Like I've known you for um, for like twenty years now. But that's what that's what a real friend is. Somebody you don't got to see for a couple of years, and then when you see him again, it's like you ain't never Picked even left. Really left off. Yeah, that's re- that's that real energy. That's real. <coughs> but yeah, I've been. I'm reading a lot more. I'm taking vacations and shit. You know, I never wanted to go nowhere. Yeah, no, I'm glad, bro. And that that that's really because of the girl you with too, bro. She bringing out the best of you as your best friend. I know that. Yeah, no, that's my dog. I know it ain't no pill you drinking. I know it ain't no, no nothing you doing, nigga. It's genuinely hers. The same way my fiance has brought the best out in me. Like, we maturing, nigga. We get to that, that different level. Maturing. Maturing. We're, we're not. <laughs> no, it's mature, but we're, the way we doing it, we're maturing. Yeah, like Taylor May. I'm Taylor yeah. making this suit right now, getting this shit right, getting this shit puffy and duffy, and that's why. Everything I do, I'm just getting more fine wine with it. You feel me? Like even this weed, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like you're refining your flavors and shit. All that to the point where I'm I'm crazy enough to do this research and film and smoke and talk with other people about what they're feeling to just find that ultimate genetic, nigga. So I, you know, like you said, I could do a po- Pepsi and cola off this shit. Yeah, find your flavor and master that shit. But honestly, right now, we live in a beautiful time, bro, because we live in an age where the weed 
is still independent in the independent owner's hands, like by laws and shit. But pretty soon there's going to be co cigarette corporations going to come. And, bro, all this shit we talking about is going to be oh, man, in the shit, past. That shit been happening. That shit been going on, man. That shit is happening, right? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying, bro. In the future, our kids are gonna be like, "Hey, yo, you, you guys were around when niggas like did, you know?" We gonna be like, "Yeah, actually, niggas used to grow weed in houses. Niggas used to buy out warehouses in LA and yeah. blow them up. That's yeah. gonna, that's gonna be our <laughs> like, yeah, blow them up. It's, it's crazy, bro. We know where they are. Anyway, no, I was, I was thinking, bro, like. Put it like this, do you think weed's ever going to reach the point, uh, like the point that tobacco has, like you know in Australia, I think they proposed a bill to raise, I think it's Australia, don't fact, don't fact check me on that, but I think they're proposing a bill to raise the age of buying tobacco one year, every year, until they can completely phase out smoking tobacco, or like cigarettes, not necessarily tobacco, but so so wait what explain that do you what think we do? will ever reach the point <coughs> of tobacco like how oh oh i see what you're saying yeah 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 nigga cannabis i think could one day be at the level of tobacco and it probably already is it just isn't recorded nigga Look, you know how many people wake up and smoke cannabis every day nigga yeah like me you bruh my girl but look, let me tell you something i'm high as a bitch right now I'm usually really good with words. I've been trying to figure out one specific word for like eight minutes, bro. I don't know. I don't even. I can't even explain to you what the word is. Like that means for eight minutes, he's just been on autopilot. All that bro. shit he's been talking about is autopilot conversation. Nah, I'm not, I, he, he back. He not thinking about that I'm, word. No I'm more. lucid and coherent, but in the whole time I've been trying to find this perfect word, I don't think it exists no more. <laughs> Hit that shit. So you see what I'm saying? Regular weed only gives you certain type of relaxation, body high. Good weed go get you high, forgetting words. My nigga Kevin, he's very smart. He don't forget words. He's the smartest nigga out of all our friend group. Like he might as well should have been white, nigga. Smart. I say white or smart got something to do, but they do. You know what I'm saying? I'm very knowledgeable. I'm knowledgeable, like very knowledgeable. I feel like if I was a smart as I am knowledgeable, we wouldn't be here right now. Nigga, we exactly where we need to we, be, nigga. You, I ain't tripping. I like where we at. If I could, yeah. I'll, oh, bro, life is good. It's good. I am not complaining, That's but I good. feel like if I could apply a lot oh, of knowledge nigga, I have. Of course, nigga. If we would have golfed when we were in high school, we would have been killing it. Just, if, 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 if you had a of mind. football and, and fucking really fucking with the school shit and really, like, Nigga, I think about it all the time. I'm like, man, nigga, if I, somebody would have really explained to me what a fucking lawyer was, I think I would have been good at that. I wanted to be a dentist. The fuck, the fuck was I doing? <laughs> I wasted so much time. It was mad time, nigga. They put your mad classes to learn how to take teeth out of a nigga mouth. Like, that's going to happen already. I Shout out to all the dentists out there, though, my nigga. Because oh, when I get a toothache, nigga, ain't, no, ain't nothing funny. Do you remember when... I had to, when I was staying at your house for a few days, and you had to take me to the dentist? Yeah, bro, that's just serious, bro. The dentist is real, man. It's just serious. My nigga Ernesto, Ernesto nursed me like I was a baby. Because <laughs> I've been there. They got all, all four wisdom teeth out, taken out at one time. That's exactly what they did to me. No, I think they took two out. Yeah, so I knew your pain. I was fucked. Yo, they woke me up, and it, I just remember them saying this. Yeah. Your, your friend is here. Check monk. And I, and I jumped up too fast. I, rem I remember them getting a little stronger. They were like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And I fell into Ernesto's arms. And then I woke up in this nigga bed confused as hell. That's the old. I don't remember nothing else. My man's an angel. Got him. Took care of the boy. No, it is. Real friendship. That's what it is, bro. I've Friendship and weed for 20 years. Friendship <laughs> and infinity. weed. That's the that's the name of this episode. Friendship and weed. So now that you smoked it, you that's feeling better. you feeling the high. Yeah. What 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 you think? I ain't gonna lie. Okay, so we so we about we smoked about that much of this one, right? <laughs> we're about the same. We got at the same point. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. that motherfucker went between the legs and dunked on this motherfucker. Yeah, 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 yeah look, look. look. All right, I was talking a little crazy. 
That that white <laughs> cherry gelato <laughs> is it, like he said. If it's at the house, you're yeah. gonna smoke it. It's right there. I'll throw that shit into the course right now. <laughs> you get yeah. the fuck out of here. Nah, it's it's, it's traffic smoke in it's LA. Good. It's time you smoking traffic. You feel me? Cause you smoke, you start smoking this shit in traffic, you not gonna go home, nigga. You gonna find out, you gonna find something creative to do. I was gonna say, you gonna find something to do. <laughs> like, you know, just, let me pull on, let me get over for Wilson real quick. There yeah. might be something happening. Yeah, right yeah. I feel a little creative right yeah. now. I'm for sure going home off the gelato. The gelato, you yeah, going home, going home. you jumping on the PS, uh, Xbox, you chilling, you good. It's dead. Thanks. Put on, fuck, that's delicious. Yeah, you smoke this little motherfucker shit right here. I pay attention, look, look, pay attention, bruh, you fucking, we smoking this to the, to the tent, to the nigga. Tent. No, this shit ain't even open, like, like, look, this shit ain't open, and ain't nothing to smoke. This should I roll another one? I'm, let's roll the last of it, fuck it, I'll, I'll roll the last of it with you, let's do it, fuck it, Cause, let's do it, bro. let's do it, bro. let's do it, you see, that's what we had to do, we had to warm up, now that, now that we, for the record, now that we I on this do it, bro, I'm trying to tell you, I know you could do it out of it, but <laughs> what's this going to do for me later? Yeah. What, what, compared to what it's going to do for us right now. I ain't mad at you, man. You feel me? I ain't mad at you. Yeah. Yo, so what the fuck? Uh, my nigga, did he really did it? What's going on right now? The worst kept secret in the world? We actually going to question it? I know, I know, I know, I know. There is never a worst kept secret ever. Yo, I think niggas is more shocked about the 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 the, the, the UFO shit. <laughs> <laughs> My whole thing was like, bro, you know the fucking like, tell all. We're t- doing the interviews and shit. Like, oh no. Okay. I remember. Look, I don't like telling the story, but I'm gonna tell it. I snitched on a nigga one time on accident just because I was talking too much. <laughs> just literally, niggas was questioning me real hard, and like, bro, I just got, I bro, I got tired of like beating around the bush. And I'm like, but you know this nigga James B. Stealing. He coming my mouth and shit. <laughs> so this is the bro. I just don't talk about nobody. I don't talk that much. Don't talk about nobody. This nigga been talking about this shit his whole life. Like it's time. Wrap him up. Yeah. Like it's weird though. Like it's weird. It's some sucker shit. But you know, you been told on yourself. Yeah. As a, as a nigga who accidentally snitched one time, I'ma just say don't <laughs> talk. Don't say nothing. Just quiet. <laughs> Quiet. Quiet, man. Your, your, your intention could be pure as fuck. Like, nah, nigga, I ain't never gonna tell him my man. Just one sentence too much. Fucked. Oh my god. Look, did you see all that happiness just come out the grinder? No. Just happiness. <laughs> no. Happiness. I'm, only, I'm smoking this out of camaraderie. I would much rather be drinking a mango cart and hitting golf balls. <laughs> but that's just me. Hey, I ain't mad at you, bruh. Look, you see, you gotta do the crumble. It's different. It's for sure different. It give it, That's the most different shit I've seen today. It give it. It give the paper texture. What? The, I'm trying to think if I've seen some more different shit today, and I haven't. For real? Yeah. Oh. I, got, I got another yellow watermelon. I guess that's different. Oh, what? Yeah. Bro, you see, I'm into that shit. The same way I'm into, like, eating and smoking... Exotic weed. I like eating exotic watermelons yeah. like that. Start bro. buying y'all fruits and veggies from farmers markets, niggas. For real, bro. That's where y'all begin on. That's how y'all just got that shit at the house. Yeah, huh? no, we got we get everything from a farmers market. Like on Tuesdays, we just go to one by the crib, get our fruits and shit, fruits and veggies. You know what I fuck with? Why, why, why that like? What's gonna make me really want to go do that, bro? Cause last time we was golfing, your girl brought those watermelons, bro. And besides them just being like yellow watermelons, bro, they had seeds in them, nigga. Oh, bro. No, when you go to even Trader Joe's, none of the fucking fruits have seeds in them. Seedless watermelons, bro. I be growing everything. I'm, I'm born I'm, in the '90s, my nigga. We had seeds in our watermelons. Like I don't think anyone yeah. born after 2003 knows that watermelons are supposed to have seeds. Like facts, bro. That's crazy. Fruits I used to take, don't have I used seeds to take, no more. I used to take shits in and the, the seeds. seeds were in there. Come on, man. 
Come on, man. There ain't no seeds in the food, bro. We know what the fuck y'all up to, bro. GMOs, man. Hey, listen. What, what's a GMO? I never grew a GMO in my life, nigga. Why is that in every food? <laughs> you know, not if I like, bro, you, you can't do it. Anyway, listen. Oh, that's what I'm going to provide you, Sean. I'm going to come here weekly. I'm going to press you niggas into going to the farmer's markets and there live a sustainable life, nigga. Stable living. It's kind of hypocritical while I make clothes. <laughs> but whatever. It's all right, man. Yeah. It's all right. It's like Virgil, nigga. Be Virgil out, nigga. Fashion is different. Virgil out. You could Virgil out, my nigga. Yeah. Be you. You could you could Virgil out. Bro. Tell niggas like just like that. Virgil out, bro. Niggas like like bro. Limes don't even be having seeds. Like yeah, you bite into a lime and they're not, like I don't get it. It's nuts. It's nuts. No, it's it's it's, it's really out of pocket. And they did it so well that you ain't even realizing until like nobody, nobody until you like thirty. Nobody, nobody peeping game. You just said it perfect. Until you're thirty, nobody gives a fuck until you're thirty. What is it? Your back start hurting. Your joints say You got you got to do your googles, and then you realize you're not eating organic food and shit. That's really what it is. Like you know, I feel like at twenty nine, I felt like I was slowing down, but at thirty, nigga. I was like, yo, my body feels different. My men- I feel mentally younger than I ever have, but, you know, now I have to feel, I feel like to be as strong as I used to be, I gotta, like, you gotta attack that shit. Big facts, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Sitting right here and doing this podcast in front of the golf course, all it really want, made me want to do the whole time is want to go golf. We about to golf the shit out of golf, this shit. Golf, 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 Once golf. we done with this little uh, smoking review right here, we about to golf the fuck out of this course one more time for the sun go down. One more time. Man. That's definitely what we is about to fucking do. We have do. floodlights because you know they, they do got lights, lights here. Okay, it doesn't matter. We got pause. I, pause. I got my sticks. A uh, pre pause. My clubs. And we got bright balls. Pause. Plenty of balls. Pause. Big pause, big pause on the balls, pause, big pause, pause. Man, so shit. I'm been neglecting the fuck out the mic. Hold up, my bad. It's all good. So let's, man, let's get let's let's get this bitch one more last review, man, before we get out of here. Hi, I don't want it no more, nigga. Get the fuck, <laughs> the fuck, nigga. <laughs> Here's your review. Suck my dick. <laughs> Try to tell niggas, man. Try to tell man, I'm gonna niggas. One, I'm gonna give this one an eight point two. Okay, okay, well, shit, what, what would be a 10? So, Astro Tech, that Astro Tech shit I gave you? Those? Out of respect, the weed I bought from, I don't know the shop's name by heart, they, gave, they sent me a text this morning, but the weed I bought over the weekend was the best weed I've had in about wow. 10 years. We, bro, we, let's, go buy, let's go buy it and smoke it on the show. We need yeah. to. We, we got to review it. We can it. go get it. I was thinking about going to get some tonight, but yeah, we can go, I'm going to go get some. Bro, we if we, the, honestly the minute we go get that flavor, we gotta go do another podcast episode. I gotta go spit real quick. Hold on. Go spit. Spit your thing. I think I had to go spitty. Go spit on these niggas. You know what I mean? Hit them niggas with the Drake. Ow, bow, ow. But yeah, we right here chilling, Willie. She's getting another review on the Jesus, a baby Jesus, because it, it, it honestly deserves it. And the reason why I led with the other. Batch of the uh, what you see, good g- bad weed. You don't even remember the name. This shit, baby Jesus, nigga. <laughs> you could knock me out, Mike Tyson, and wake up and ask me, Yo, what's that weed we smoke? Blah blah blah. I'll be like, Baby Jesus, nigga. This shit, I just smoked it a, a minute ago. What's it called? White cherry gelato. You see, it's like whatever, dog. It's so it's old, bro. It's old. Y'all tried it. You feel me? And, and you know what's the fucked up part is. I wonder if that even is white cherry gelato. Maybe that's some bullshit somebody gave somebody and named it that. It sucks because wherever the real white cherry gelato is, because... Everything is called that shit. Nobody know what that shit is no more. That's what I'm saying. You really got to be tapped in to be like, on bro, this level of weed. I don't know what happened to just Girl Scout cookies. Everything is like the cookies. I got it. Fusion. I just I just made a clone of I don't believe uh, nobody has like their own Like I popped I it. I popped the Girl Scout. 2011 
Girl Scout cookies. I want 2012 Skywalker. You see what I'm saying? That's how, the, that's, how the, that's how the that's how the 2015 cake batter, nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what, you mean? what the fuck is going on? Man, that's the fucking market right now, and it makes it so hard for the grower. Cause then the grower looking at you like, wait, nigga, do you know how long it takes to grow this? You know how many spots we got to really grow this Didn't shit? Do it. <laughs> and that's what niggas is doing, and 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 at the end, the payout isn't enough. Cause once they do all that hard work, they bring it to an, an, a middleman, and yeah. that nigga, what's what he gonna do? Yeah, yeah. Thirteen hundred to a hundred yeah. to a hundred. Come on, my nigga. If I get all of them, can I get them for eleven? <laughs> you know these niggas is sick, bro. Listen, man. Listen, <laughs> niggas don't even want to deal with that. Nigga, that's why it's best to grow that small batch gasoline. I like this shit better when it was illegal. Uh, you feel me? It made it more fun, right? Put niggas on the corner again. <laughs> <laughs> I want to meet niggas on the block. SMPM, nigga. Like, make sure there ain't no street lights on there, nigga. Give me a fucking... Ow. Give me a fucking zip, zip lock, nigga. Like, hey, I don't yeah. give a fuck if it's point eight under. Yo. Yo. Gas, nigga. Yo. Take it back to the old days. Yo, yo. <laughs> and it's funny you say that, because I will bring up the old days, because I've known, I known you a long time. You, you the type of nigga that, like, yo, this nigga used to have a weed, man. I used to make this nigga on scavenger hunts for his weed, nigga. I swear to God, remember? He yeah. tell you, hey, look, I put it behind a pot, and you just got to go. <laughs> One time we were going to pick a weed for this nigga. Yo, bro was outside. He's like, bro, I can't find it. <laughs> for real. No, I ain't going to lie. Shut My man used to put, you know, he. I used to go buy zips from him, and I'm like, well, nigga, I ain't going to be at your house for like 30 minutes. My man would... Just stash it in a like a vacant mailbox, like a broken mailbox or something. I was like, all right, nigga. Every time it was somewhere different, though. Yeah, That's the shit that got different. me hot. No, but see, I used to figure it out quick. So you know what I mean? You put the money in where the weed was, and I sent that nigga the eagle emoji for the eagle has landed. <laughs> and then nigga go get the bread. Like eagle has landed. Go yeah. get it. And the shit was gas. Was it not? It was some different type of gas. Like it was high level shit. It was, it, it was, cause I, I would always tell Kev, hey bro, let's go get that weed from that one nigga. It wasn't a convenient drive to go get it, and we did it. But it was worth it, and the <laughs> weed makes you do that, like this one. That's my point. The weed, the weed I'm talking about, the shop I went to was West Hollywood, and like, I'll do that shit again. Bro, West I'll do that, I'll do that shit every day. Like, West Hollywood has really good fucking weed, bro. All the big brands, like, are the niggas trying to become, have a name. For some reason, they think going to West Hollywood is where it's at, but I get it. It's where the, they, niggas, niggas, niggas spending over there, right? No, no we hope is where it's at. You niggas spending. You saw I went to go party in WeHo. My first, <laughs> my first WeHo experience. I seen this Instagram story. I was like, oh, yeah. It is what it is. My niggas, my niggas, my niggas seen it. He's experiencing it. I like it. It's, it's pretty wild out there, B. It's wild. I like it. It's wild. I'm a, I'm a wild nigga. Hey, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, nah, some, some, it was cool. Me and my girl, we had a good ass time. Yeah, nah, yeah, you and your girl, y'all, that, that's what made it cool. And I was like, yeah, that's cool. My nigga out there with his girl. Because it's, it's it, we who, if you with your girl, it's, 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 it's I would, funny. I'm it's, never it's, going it's a crazy place. I'm never going by myself. Yeah, if you, if I'm you not wanna, going with you. you. <laughs> <laughs> if you a single nigga with we who, hell no, nah, it ain't yeah, it. No, nah, I ain't going with you the wrong nigga. Or I ain't going with solo. <laughs> Bro, I'll go. You set you setting yourself up. I know that. That shit is know that. <laughs> know that. Or you might be, might be one. I hit that nigga. I hit that shit like four, five times. Nigga. This nigga, this nigga I, do. I don't want to do shit. Man. <laughs> I, I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. All right, cool, cool. I'm just making sure that's what it is. I'm like, I'm like, okay, yo, Kevin really high. So, my fucking nigga. So, this joint got you high. I'm just sitting here like, all right. <laughs> you right, bro. This. I told you, remember first hit, I was like, bro, I'm already high. Yeah, you know, nigga, I smoke weed too, nigga. I've been smoking all day. Now I'm, I'm smoked out, officially. Fuck, bro. This is a good ass flavor again. See, and imagine this. Imagine, look, this is me smoking, right? Mm. So, in that joint, mm. you probably got three, three bomb ribs, maybe four. Right. I sit down, I take one of those. Wow. It takes two seconds. Don't smoke again for three hours. This is a lot. I'm good. <laughs> I get it. 
You know what I mean? I get it. You know what? At this point, I'm just smoking this shit to smoke. To it. just do it. I don't do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But if I used so to do that, good, bro. It feels like Ugh. strawberry Russian cream coming out my mouth, nigga. Yeah, that's a, that's something we used to do, and then go take a nap and eat up all your food. Yeah. It keeps me going, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Keeps me going. <laughs> it should keep you going, bro. Shit, fucking. This is. This shit's different. No thank you. My nigga. Hey, so is it smoking? Another episode. We out here getting to it. Make sure to comment. Let us know what flavors you want us to try. We definitely gonna try the flavor he was talking about. I'm gonna bring two of them things. Cause we, you know, that we, that's what we out here doing. We out here getting to it, testing them, and giving y'all the raw, organic fucking review. And um, watch out for any fucking um, um, what was the name of that flavor again? <laughs> Good joke. Uh, you know, watch out for the fucking white, white gelato. Watch out for the white cherry gelato fakers. Quote unquote. Cause you seen how the interview, the, the interview, the, the podcast first started, and you seen how it ended. Get you some good weed, man. We out. <laughs> <laughs>